We've made it the last night of the festival. I just came from the Asheville Comedy Festival, so I'm on my 13th day of double festing. It's cute. My son just turned 18. You guys know what that means? I will no longer be known as the defendant's mother. That's good. There's a mom over there. He turned 18, he wanted wheels for his birthday, so I got him a U-Haul. <laughs> and a hand truck. <laughs> You're out. <laughs> My son is ADHD, dyslexic, and goth. <laughs> That's not the joke. <laughs> he just got a tattoo put on backwards <laughs> so he could read it. It's not the worst tattoo. When he turned 18, he got a tattoo of a microphone on his neck. <laughs> no, it's weird, right? Lady at the store goes, oh my God, why does your son have a microphone on his neck? And my kid said, because my mom's a stand-up comedian. I know, it's a good thing he didn't know what a dick his dad was. <laughs> I just busted him smoking weed. That's an awkward moment between a mom and a kid. We were both just standing there in the alley. <laughs> he goes, Mom, you smoke weed? I was like, what? He said, do you got any? And I said, no, call your Uncle Todd. He goes, Uncle Todd smokes weed. And I started laughing. I was like, oh, shit, you still think Uncle Todd is your uncle. That's... I just got married. I waited till I was 50, but I married someone that's 40. Yeah, if you ladies want to get a ring this big, you move to Seattle and learn how to play Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> he's an internet security specialist. For you tech guys, you know that he's a professional hacker that goes in but he hid his business card from me, ladies, for the first 10 years we dated. His business card says penetration specialist. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I married a penetration specialist. It doesn't get any funnier than that. I checked with DC Comics. There's no Colonel Penetrator. That's as high up as you go. He's a big guy we met on sugardaddy.com. I thought it was a bake sale, so it was a little. I used to date little guys like you, but I kept losing them. I'd wake up in the middle of the night, I'd be like, where'd he go? Marco. Marco. Do you hear me? He goes. <laughs> Are you guys married? Uh, we fight. And he says, I start the fight, ladies. I start it just by saying, what's wrong with you? <laughs> I guess it's this. <laughs> so I figured out I just need to get him to say what's wrong with you. And then I win the fight, right? <laughs> So I figured out how to do it. I call it Revenge of the Amazon Women. <laughs> Anytime I'm mad at him, I just start charging shit on his Amazon account. <laughs> you see these beads right here? They're a dollar a pack. I charged a hundred packs <laughs> within four minutes, individually. You know what that does to a man's cell phone when he's sitting at work, sir? <laughs> bing, 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 bing. He called me up, he said, honey, are you charging stuff on the Amazon account? This is tricky, ladies, you have to say it just like this. Yep. <laughs> he said, what's wrong with you? It's my win. 
The next time I was mad at him, I charged 300 feet of hose. <laughs> he called me instantly and he said, did you just charge 300 feet of hose? And I said, yep. I'm trying to figure out how much hose I need to hook the car exhaust up to your sleep apnea machine. <laughs> Thank you, you guys. What a great time. You guys are amazing.